On entertainment news, the wife of Oshun State Governor Kafayat Uyetola Kafayat has inaugurated the Oshun International Fashion Week, which runs for three days. The initiative is to sensitize the residents on the need to be conscious of socio-cultural issues. The clearing the week opened in Oshubo, Oyetola's wife describes the initiative as a round peg in a round hole, saying it is coming at a time the nation has resolved to diversify its economy towards sustainable development. The governor's wife says the gesture is to reposition the Adire textile industry. She says it is cheering to note that the state had begun to leverage on indigenous resources to grow its revenue base. She advocates the need for the members of the State Executive Council to adopt a policy that will make a direct attire a must wear at least one day in a week in the various offices of government. I thank the organizers of the, this week for dedicating this to the Adire industry. It reflects the fact that we are now beginning to leverage on indigenous resources to grow our revenue based and boost the economy of our states. Commissioner for Culture and Tourism at DBC Obawali says the initiative has been designed to provide employment opportunities for the team and youth and job seekers in the state. According to him, about 120 young fashion models will be retrained to broaden their skills, after which they will be taken abroad to expand the scope of their businesses. Alaye Mori of Idoshu or Baade Dakbo Adiremi speaks on the need for the black race, particularly the Yorubas, to go back to the drawing board and take their position as the best cultured and value inclined nation. We have to embrace our culture, especially the uh, the great ones, which are enduring legacy from generations to generations. Um, we have to expunge the harmful practices, which are so-called culture, because we are the custodian of culture. Hello. Hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.